Okay, so uh, this is a switch, a, a dockable switch case that I picked up on uh, Amazon for 12 bucks. It is a grip case, allows you to put games in it, but I don't recommend it. It's a little, you have to take the whole case off. It's kind of hard to take the case off and it doesn't really, uh, there's nowhere to really properly put the, the game cases the game cartridges, and they'll just probably fall all over the place if you do that. But this is the Neo uh, protective case. They made another case that was like the uh, Skull & Co. one, uh, except it's a little cheaper. They also sell that, but that one doesn't fit in the dock. This one has cutouts for the dock, and it has all the ports and everything you need um, on the back and everything. And we're going to drop this in the dock. And that's that. So we're going to put this in the dock. You do have to press it down a little firmly the, like the first few times you use it. But it eventually goes in the dock. And it's very easy. It just comes right out. Goes in. And that's as simple as that. Now, of course, if you have like a really warped dock, it may not work. But, you know... You, uh, if you don't, you know, if you have a fairly straight dock, this should work. Um, there is the grip on the back of the, the case here so that it makes it more comfortable if you have larger hands. There's cutouts for the, um, for this and everything, everything has a cutout, uh, including things that I don't even know why I like. I guess maybe just to not be bumped up against this so that it can fit in the dock. I don't know. Um, so, yeah, whatever. The button for the Joy-Con has a cutout. Um, then, of course, I've tried multiple headphones here, and they all fit. And of course, you have an opening for your cart port. Um, it's been fairly comfortable to use. And... Uh, about it it's not as comfortable as this this is the um what is this I'm trying to remember this is the go play uh grip case thingy grip um this comes goes on very easy and comes off very easy and it is super comfortable to use um so yeah and that's out and you can get it fairly cheap and it also comes with a in a uh, pack with a whole bunch of shit that you can get at Target. But on Amazon, you can go and buy the grip by itself um, fairly cheap. And what else? What else, man? Um, this is the case it comes It also comes, they throw in some kind of like generic pop socket thing in the case for your phone or whatever. So you can use this stand. And uh, there's rain hitting my air conditioner. But yeah, so that's that. So if you're looking for a dockable case, there's one for 12 bucks. You don't have to spend a 50 or whatever it is on the um, Skull & Co. one. You just don't get the removable, uh, the removable um, grips, which I personally don't. It's nice, but I don't really care that much about that. The only thing I like is I like that you can put the games in the grips, but, you know... This, you could do that. It's just not very good. Um, but that's it. The case is really thin. It's uh, about a, it's kind of a rubberized mat feeling to it. Um, so it doesn't slip out of your hands. It doesn't get, you know, it doesn't get uh, fingerprints all over it. And, yeah. Not much else to it. Like the way the back looks. <laughs> um... So I guess that's, that's about it. So thank you for watching.